Shields up, Iron Breakers. Rurikun here coming at you with another video. Welcome back to Armored Core 6. We're going to be continuing the main campaign here today. Before we begin, though, I would like to point out we finally did the right thing and we edited our uh, emblem here, which I still hadn't done because I've just been focused on, oh, I want to advance a little bit, get some episodes of the Let's Play done prepare for like a beginner's guide and all of that stuff i didn't really have time to play around with the image editor and holy crap it is really powerful by the way this was not on the pc this was all done on playstation 5 this was just done using like basic elements and i'll be real i think it looks really good is it's not exactly like solaire's shield but it's as close as it's probably going to get for someone with my limited artistic uh design proficiency let's call it that and it's actually really cool if you guys look at, at this this is the first time i experimented with it but if you guys look at this like these are all the layers that i use to make the thing and yeah i really like it i really like how in-depth this thing is and how well supported it's on console also something else that you might notice is that i've put something in my in my armored core which is this i was like we're kind what the hell is that you guys might have noticed if you pay attention to my previous episodes on armored core 6 a lot of times i kill things by running over them so i figured i might as well convert them to my religion of the warriors of sunlight so as i am running them over i'm giving them one last chance to praise the sun as they're going away so yeah, we're gonna keep that one there. You know, it's all good. <laughs> I love the way that it looks. Like whenever I look to the left on the on the garage screen, I love the way that it looks. Just like printed over there on my big meaty armored core. Now, <clears throat> let's take a look at our assembly. Not a whole lot has changed, but with the things that I've learned from Cowboy in the podcast, because I believe this might be the first episode that's been recorded after the podcast because I've, I've been really really busy boy but uh one of the things was that the heads affect your scan distance so i went ahead and i got the Kazwar 44z which also has pretty good attitude uh, stability so it's not necessarily a bad thing and it has like the highest scan distance so hopefully it will help me find more treasures as we go along but you know who knows i'm assuming there's an even better version of this so yeah so we got a couple of missions here i guess we'll get started with eliminating the honest brute uh eliminate honest brute a dozer hiding out in grid 12 x rewards based on number of enemies destroyed okay let's see who we're working for i'll cut to the chase oh carla this is about the ice worm that institute relic you had a run-in with oh Corpse might stand a chance if it were just the PCA they were teaming up against. But that monster is a whole other story. You can't just throw bodies at it. The thing that makes it such a pain in the ass is its perpetual reactive shield. Coral Tech. Takes advantage of the coral's directivity. Ordinary weapons can't touch it. So let's get extraordinary. I can make you something that'll punch a hole in that shield. But I'll need your help. Overred rail cannon. You'll be heading to grid 012. One of the first sectors they built. And it's barely holding up. That's where a little rat who betrayed R.A.D. is hiding out. Goes by the name of Honest Brute. His AC Milktooth was built by us. So it's oh, flaws that it's didn't I kill him already? Him. In the arena? When he ran from R.A.D., he didn't just take credits in tech. He also took a secret project of mine. That bastard. And that secret project is what we'll need to bust open the Ice Worm shield. Oh, I hope it's a new, uh, shoulder weapon. <laughs> Let's go, baby! Let's go. You ready for this, tourist? I'm always ready, Carla. You know me. No one's gonna miss Brute. And we all stand to gain. Sounds good to me.
Sounds mighty good to me. Main system activating combat mode. Oh yeah, thank you boys. I'm All back. Right, Taurus. I'll tell you where to go. This time praising the sun too. Welcome, Taurus. It's a delight to enjoy the company of a visitor from so far away. Brute. We're here to take back what you stole from us. Oh heavens. You're a friend of Carla's. Splendid. Any friend of Carla's is a friend of mine. Here's to new beginnings. By all means, be my guest. See what I mean, tourist? We need to go deep down. I'm not gonna be able to reach there. I was looking at that platform over there. Did I just see a missile whiz by me? Definitely heard something. Yeah, like I was looking at one of the platforms has a little light on it. The one above us there. And I thought I'd be able to get there, but... Would I be able to get on top of this? Ooh, that's risky. Lovely. What about if I go from here? Would I be able to get there? Let's find out. Something tells me this is not going to work. Oh uh, no! Quick, grab on! Okay, this is fine. What the crap? Whoa, 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 whoa! Don't shoot at me! Listen here, buddy. Oh, I guess whoever that was changed their mind. A combat log. Tom's record, Coyote Chatter. I don't know about our new boss. Think we can trust him? You think Carla's better? She's got nerve to call herself a friggin' cinder. Nice try, lady, but you're a little young for that stolen valor. Man, are those people at Rad full of shit or what? Okay. Let's take a look, see, see which platform we should go to next. Oh, they actually tell me where I'm supposed to go. But I kind of want to explore these places a little bit more. Oh wow, we're at the upper area limit, actually. Jesus, all the way down there? Make sure you keep clear of the laser sensors. They're set to activate the enemy machines. Eee. A new friend from afar, just for me. What joy. Be still my beating heart. Oh, you are going to get so wrecked, my guy. I wasn't busy exploring, I'd tell you a thing or two. I don't know exactly why I'm doing this. I'm just like, I want to find treasures! And the game's like, no, stop, you're too high. I don't even do drugs! What do you mean I'm too high? <clears throat> You're overdosing on tank awesomeness, Rurikon. Jesus Christ, look at all those lasers. Is that a treasure over there? I can't tell. There's too many friggin' lasers down there, though. That almost looks like a treasure like that right there. But I'm not sure. Do I want to go down there? Kinda not. But we have to do it, I guess. See ya! Okay, that sorts it. It is! 
It is a treasure, right? Yes. Now, why would you go and do something stupid like that? I'm just chilling over here and you gotta be an asshole about it? Like, what the crap, dude? Oops. WB0010 Double Trouble. Double Trouble. I wonder what that one is. Hello! Did I just trigger, like, all of the alarms in this facility? Raise it! Almost didn't make it. Bro, I am playing so terribly. Too much time spent editing videos, not enough time spent playing friggin' Armored Core. That's the problem right there. Bro, really? Now you're messing with my, with my wallet right here. Did you guys, uh, stop? Oh, hello. Oh, come on, I got stuck there. Praise it. We're gonna bring the word of our Lord Solaire to every heathen. Oh my god, this is not good. Why did I even jump in the middle of all these lasers? I didn't have to do that. I'm just a completionist idiot. That's the problem. Boink. One repair kit remaining. Hopefully it makes the episode a little bit more entertaining for you. I'm trying to give you some value for your time, alright? That's what I'm trying to do here. Anyway, who we got? Where where are these dudes aiming from? From down there? Oh look at it, they're in a weir. Yo, bro, 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 bro. Yo, 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 aww. Why can I not target this guy all of a sudden? Seriously? Alright. Praise it! You guys think that guy was praising all the way to the ground? A little sip of tea. Delicious. Okay. Do we get to fight the big boy now? Oh, no. Quick, quick, slow. 
Seems pretty reasonable to me. Considering the way that those dudes are aimed, we should sneak in from behind. Yep. Why can't I lock on to these? What's going on there? It's like you lock on to them, but then they might have like FCS jammers or something. Oh! I got contact on something. Or maybe not. I want to say I got a ping. Uh oh. Can I not go into the crane here? I guess not. Okay, it's time to head back then. Yeah, you can't go inside it at all. I know guys, I'm just exploring random things. Somebody shooting at me? Well, why would you go ahead and do that? Okay, let's start heading towards our objective. I think I'm gonna stop, like, um, trying to find treasures in the missions themselves and just look for those outside of um, recordings, because. I feel like it just takes too long of me not really doing much. Just messing around trying to find a random treasure. I am very Don't sorry. See what y'all are doing. Did they disable it? Yeah, I figured I wasn't going to reach the top this way. I guess I'm supposed to go in from the sentry point. Okay. There's a way in. Road can't be far. We should keep an eye out for traps. They'll be much more dangerous in tight quarters. Boom. 
my best to welcome you. I do hope you'll enjoy your stay, friend. Oh, another treasure. What's in here? Bad cook. So the double trouble and the bad cook. Well, I might as well get my money's worth considering how much repair I'm gonna be losing, so. Interesting, was I not supposed to come this way? Because I can't find a path forward from here. Oh, maybe just go straight down? Oh, lovely. These things are highly inefficient, Carla. I can see their big red laser. Like, what exactly are you expecting that these things will actually do? Are they supposed to be efficient because we can't, we can't target them through the FCS? Because I can, at the end of the day, just skill, shot, skill shoot them. Except I didn't get a resupply shirt. Sure, Can I go to the top part? Is that a thing? Those are some very tight limitations from software. I'm just trying to explore. Why are we landing right next to a fuel tank? Two fuel tanks, three fuel tanks. He's gonna blow this place sky high. Watch him blow us to smithereens because we're dumb enough to come down here. the friggin flamethrower stop that oh I was downright sexual brute you like that real cute of you, honest brute. 
I wasn't playing around so much at the beginning of this mission, I would have had all of my repair kits to beat his ass. Sucker. Jump down there and we've got him cornered. Don't forget, the guy's a rat. This won't be smooth sailing. Is this place some kind of hangar? The target AC must be nearby. My new friend, you're here at last. Brute! Ah, oh, Carla, you've introduced me to such wonderful people. Wonderful things. Shut up, tourist. The sweet melody of the generator. How Milkyu's heart sings. Not that AC at RAD, tourist. Not exactly sure what you're trying to do up there, buddy, but okay. You don't want to come on down? How the rail cannon weeps. Torn from their mother. Oh, they must be okay. Carla so. I weep too. Come on down anytime slow. you want, bro. Slow. Quick, quick, slow. 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 Quick, quick, slow. Let's trip the light fantastic friend. There you are. Oh no. Right into a pile bunker. Thank you. Enemy AC is silent. Looks like he's dead. Good. Yeah. All right, tourist. I'll see about retrieving our secret project. We'll need it to go worm hunting. Worm hunting. Still made 389k, that's not too bad. Chainsaw, double trouble. Flamethrower, bad cook. Okay. Detonating missile launcher, javelin beta. My, my. One new message. Chatty Stick, R.A.D. Thanks for putting down Brute. The Chief's already in the workshop tweaking the rail cannon. And I've never seen her happier to be at work. Did you say... So, later, tourist. Rail cannon? I'm a happy boy. I like rail cannons. Now, let me see. All of these were unlocked, so we get to just, like, try them out. Right? Flamethrower, bad cook. Weaponized form, oh, it's got 1200 rounds. Weaponized form of a tool used to melt down scrap at ultra high temperatures, continued to use at point blank range is enough to outstrip any AC's anti thermal defenses. Okay. And then chainsaw, double trouble. Originally a tool used for industrial demolition craft, now repurposed as a weapon. Charge to deploy the blades, which can be pushed into a target to rapidly accumulate damage. Okay. I mean, it ain't no pile bunker. It ain't no pile bunker, but it will hit twice. So let's check those out. Also, didn't I get something for my shoulders? The detonating missile launcher Javelin Beta. 
Special missile launcher developed by All Mine creates a chain of delayed explosions along the missile's trajectory, allowing for sustained suppressive fire even against targets that manage to evade the initial missile. Okay, let's try these bad boys out real quick. So if we go into sortie, AC test. I'm gonna be doing some of these tests on on camera because it makes sense, I think. Okay, let's see what we got. Give me a, give me a, give me some, uh, try it on. Give me a trainer AC. Ooh, that lock on time. How many of the and I can barely I, I can barely fire them? I don't I guess maybe if they're moving it's better. Oh god, that is terrible. Oh my god, yeah, that's that's real bad. Ugh. Okay, let's get rid of that. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not. I mean, I don't understand. Chain delayed explosion along the missile trajectory and sustain suppressive fire even against targets and management. I don't like it. I don't like it. Maybe I'm using it wrong. I don't care. I don't like it. I like this one. This one's good. It hits things. Now let's try the rest of it. Uh, wait, why do I still have ash meat? Gives us the double trouble. Now, sir, if you could stand perfectly still. Let me see some here. Oh, I can't boost while I'm doing this? Aww. Well, that's unfortunate. How about if I go like... Ah, uh, you're not really gonna be able to use it. I'm so confused by this weapon. You can't hold it after you do the first attack. Which would actually be what I would want to do. So you get to charge it. But the charge is way too long for it to be of any use, I feel like. So I can dodge, but I can't assault boost. And every time that I quick boost, I lose the charge. Nah. It's funny, but no. It's funny, but no. Now let's see about that flamethrower. Does it do good stagger? I guess it doesn't. All right? Yeah, this one's more about damage. It's got almost no stagger potential. And it overheats. Yeah, no, I think I'm good. I think I like the things that I usually use. They're very, very good. I like them very much. I'll stick to what I got. Until we find something better. Yeah, not using those. Now then. Sortie. 
missions, defend the old pa spaceport, or historic data recovery. Ingebret Tunnel, salvage historic data scattered throughout the subterranean tunnel. No base pay compensation derived from sal saleable data from PCA Rex. Okay. Raven, I have a personal request to ask you. It's about the Engelbert Tunnel, which is to be shut down after it was hit by a coral surge. I want to go there and survey the area. Even before the coral surge, that place had been all but abandoned. It's an old structure, dating far back into the colonization of Rubicon. There must be items of interest from throughout the planet's history there. As I'm sure you're aware, I have no resources with which to pay you. But I can propose an alternative. If you find any wrecks left by the PCA, you should try accessing them. Both the corporations and the Rubiconians are gathering data on PCA technology. Whatever you collect, I can exchange for credits and transfer the funds to you. Okay. Sounds good. I have taken a few liberties. Walter thinks you've gone on a geological survey. Thank you for doing this for me, Raven. You're quite welcome, Air. You're the only one I actually like in this place. Although something tells me she's probably going to backstab us. Makes sense. Sounds like a Miyazaki thing to do. Why would you activate Let's combat mode? Started. We're just chilling. I've already located several wrecks that we should be able to recover data from. I'll send you marker data. God, those skies look really cool. Alright. I mean, if there's ever a mission for me to explore and spam my scan, this is the one. Poppity pop pop. Sorry, sir, can I help you? That's what I thought. Okay, so we have a wreck and we have something over there. It appears to be on the other side of the door. Also, what is that? Whatever it was, it was not nice. Insects. Should have brought something that I could shoot a lot more things with. PC craft data. I'll exchange it for credits and send them to you later. Do these things not attack me? It doesn't even know I'm here. And I don't get money for killing it. So maybe I shouldn't bother. The coral is able to conduct data and can influence digital equipment. The effects of the coral surge must have brought some of the wrecks back online. Let's see what we can find. Okay.
Did you just shoot at me? Okay, see, I was trying to be nice about this, but if you guys are going to be like that, I will be forced to respond in kind. There's one all the way over there. There's some over here. Uh, oh no! Oh no! It's back, back. Oh my god! All the way to the bottom we go. No! No! There, now we're losing money, Air. This is your fault. As Air goes like, well, what the hell? I, I couldn't expect you to do dumb shit like that. I'm sorry, there's only so much these poor little tank threads can boost. Use the boost! You guys piloted bow saces? Text that extract from the wreck. This appears to come from the writings of the Thumb Dolmayan, father of the Liberation Front. How long has it been since I first saw her voice? Fear not, she said. There will always be plenty, she told me this. I was imbibing Rubicon's blessings one fateful day. If I were you, I'd never allow this, I'd replied. And I was forever shamed by my deceit. This seems to be a recording of Dolmayan, the Liberation Front's ideological leader. But this appears to be something exceptionally personal. Enemy, maybe? There's a couple of enemies up there. Let's try not to fall into the depths of an abyss. Wait, this one goes up. I think that was actually the one that I was chasing after before I fell like an idiot. Because that one goes much further in. So let's go look for that one real quick. Preferably without falling into the endless void this time. How about that? Okay. This is going to be a long mission, boys. I mean, a long episode. I, I think I should have probably made some of these episodes longer anyway. Uh-oh, uh-oh. No, 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 not like this. Wait, 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 let me rest here. It's all good. I can save this. Maybe. <coughs> Lovely. Okay, so, up this way. Come on, baby, don't let me down. Oops. Wait, what? I think I might be doing this wrong. I don't think it's this way. Urkan, what are you doing? Clearly padding out this video. That is the intent. Maybe I have to go through the one at the bottom before I get to go to that one. Oh no, it's probably higher up. Huh. 
It's a big old mess out here. Jesus, there's a lot of you boys. appreciate this nonsense that you boys are doing out here. I really don't. Why would you be this annoying? Anyway, this is all pointless. Wait, did these show up after I... Oh, they did. They showed up after I collected the data from you. I think. Aha. with everybody using flamethrowers all of a sudden. And why is it that every time I come down to this place, something bad always happens? Every time. It's a schematic for an SG craft. That better be worth something. Is all I'm saying, Air. An older generation of AC. <laughs> Professor Nagai's log. Text data extracted from a wreck. The lost auto transcription for a voice log recorded by Professor Nagai, the Rubicon Research Institute director. No, the coral tide is rising at an abnormal rate. This resonance, it suggests some kind of mutation. Run the calculations. How much time do we have? 47 hours, 2 minutes, and 16 seconds. We still have time. Deploy IBIS. According to the timestamp, this was recorded two days before the fires of IBIS. This seems to be about the warning signs of the calamity, right before it struck. Okay, time to go on down. Down, 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 down. Now listen, there, I got a really bad feeling about this, by the way. Just thought I'd mention that. Hello! Oh, wow. Quick boosted right into a rock. That's the type of AC piloting you can only expect from someone of my caliber. Okay, we're looking good here. If you'd excuse me. of you boys to show up. Hey, you remember when we blew this thing to smithereens? Those are some fun times, am I right?
Next data extracted from a wreck. The Los Angeles is still professional guy. Assistant number one has lost his mind. His research has utterly consumed him. Granted, there may be some logic to see Paul's sensory augmentation of human subjects, but no ethical scholar would ever dare cross that point of no return. Mankind is driven mad by possibilities. What does Coral represent, if not sheer potential? This is about the first augmented humans. The same Coral technology that created you. But without it, we never would have made contact. I'm not picking up any more data stores. If this outing has made you think about Lincoln's past or the future of Coral, it was all worth it. Oh, what the hell? There's something in there, though. No, we missed out on something. Wow. Very profitable, indeed. I'll go back and I'll pick that up off camera. It's not a big deal. But anyway, this episode has gone on long enough. Let's see what the notification message, message is. Probably from air, right? Oh. What kept you, 621? I was busy. You're a famous mercenary now. Time to act like one. <sighs> Just get some rest. That's the important thing. Ah, good old pally time. Always looking out for me. But anyway, team, that's going to be it for this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, hit the like button, subscribe, bell notification icon, all of that stuff. I love you, and I'll see you in the next one. Stay strong. Stay safe. Peace out.